So, you guys know that yesterday I have sent Squad 141 and my army to attack the Qvengers and the Devils. And as for Squad 141, they have successfully completed their missions. And they also have intelligence for us that I'm going to be discussing in today's video. So let's begin, shall we? Our first intelligence is that Makarov has escaped from the Gulag. Ben Bowler soldier Makarov, of course. Second intelligence is that Ben Bowler and Russell's army are officially allies against the Marcus Hunt. So, which means it is officially confirmed that the Q Vengers and the Devils are the allies in this war against the Marcus Hunt. So, my army, basically. Third intelligence the battle in Urzikstan, the Q Vengers and the Devils have killed thousands of people there, including Faris forces and my army. And it is most likely that the Qvengers are going to take over Urzikstan next. And they're going to do the same thing like what they did with Almazra. Be unstoppable. And the fourth intelligence, which isn't actually good. And that is, we have lost a member of Squad 141. And his name is John Soap McTavish. I will explain to you guys what had happened to him. So basically, the Q Vengers had placed a bomb in the tunnels, the train tunnels, that goes from Britain to France. So they were going to kill innocent people in the trains in the water by blowing up the tunnels. So Squad One for One made their way it, ugh, can't speak, made their way into the tunnels to go and find the bomb. So they were going in there, killing the Qvengers and the Devils. And then finally, they found the bomb. And then Price and Soap started to defuse the bomb. And suddenly, Makarov and Ben Bowler's men made their way in. And Makarov shot Soap in the shoulder and knocked Price onto the floor, draw his pistol at his head. And then. Soap saved Price's life, and then suddenly Makarov shot Soap right in the head this time and killed him. And then after that, he made his escape out of the tunnels while Price was shooting at him but couldn't even hit him. Well, I think he did though, but don't know where. So Ghost, Gaz, and Price. Killed the rest of the Qvengers that went with Makarov in the tunnels. And then, next after that, Price and Gaz defused the bomb together just in time. So, which means that the tunnels with all the people inside on the trains were saved. The Qvengers will pay for this for killing Soap, one of my soldiers as well. So, Soap McTavish will be truly missed from Squad 1 for 1 and the Marcus Hunt. And now for the final intelligence, General Shepard is now dead because Captain Price killed him. Because I ordered Captain Price to kill Shepard. And the reason for that is that Shepard was about to join the Devils, which would make him a villain. So, as Shepard entered his office, in the shadows was Captain Price. So he came out the shadows, talked to Shepard, then draw his pistol at him, and then shot him in the head. So basically, that was my order. So Captain Price sneaked in to the office just to kill Shepard. So that's all I've got for you folks. So once again, Soap will be truly missed. But the Qvengers and the Devils will pay for this though. They will pay for killing my men like that. 
because Soap was a really good guy and he was a hero in Squad 1 for 1. But anyways, that's going to conclude today's video. I will see you guys next time. Have a great day and night to you all. Peace out.